So, here we go. Inspired by Hero Hunter 81. Decided to take some shots of my flea market. At least the first one that I go to. It's pretty big. This is the outdoor. I've already been through that. It's it's mostly junk. But I'm about to head into the first of one of the buildings. And I'm going to go in here and go to uh, Comic Vendor. So here, 181, if you have me see this, uh, like I said, it's inspired by you. I like your flea market bids. Uh, I'd like to uh, you get to a flea market like you have there. Looks like a nice one. And uh, we'll take a look and we'll see how this one is. A lot of empty spaces in here now. As you see, it's a lot of junk too. Typical flea market stuff. A bunch of old computers coming up. Uh, here we go. So, uh, back in my truck here. This is what I came away with from the vendor. I had to cut the video in there short. They're looking at me kind of funny, and then, uh, I was kind of asked not to be filming inside um, for privacy reasons or something. I I explained that I did not get wasn't filming people. I was filming the, uh, the flea market itself and the, the merchandise available, and uh, and I still didn't seem too happy. So oh well, I tried. Maybe I'll sneak a few in next time. But I picked up a few books there. Spent ten bucks. I'll show those off later in another video. I'm gonna head down the road, uh, go to the next flea market on my way home, and uh, when I get there, I'll try to take uh, a little bit of video there. So uh, that's all for now, then. So, check out some of this uh, backwoods scenery I get to drive through on the way to the other flea market. I'm out here in the middle of nowhere. Is it really safe to be filming while I'm driving? <laughs> or recording? <laughs> oh well. Yep. Woods. Woods. And more woods. And so uh, back roads here in Georgia. And a white picket fence. Somebody's living the American dream. Alright, just figured I'd show a little bit of the scenery. Here we go, coming up to uh, the next big flea market. It's uh Ooh, watch the camera. It's mostly indoors, but it's a giant warehouse type building that they have set up with uh, aisles of booths. As you can see.
how big it is. And we go inside. It's going to be loud and crowded. Washing dryer, refrigerator, tons of speaker boxes. <coughs> so I'm headed straight to the uh, first comic book vendor. Oh, uh, here we go. I'm going to take a look around and uh, come back later. Leaving the second scene while you're there. It's way too loud and crowded to be walking around with a camera still. So, uh, hit up two vendors there and got a couple of books for one. It's about six or seven books for one and six or five books for the other. And it's not far from here. Figure. Just got a couple of comics. 